I'm going to be reviewing care of the clients with seizures. What you need to know in order to give care to the clients with seizures are the types of seizures. There are many types of seizures. I will give you one example, a myoclonic seizure. Onset happens in childhood, brief muscular contraction involving one or more limbs or trunks. So you would need to review the types of seizures and what you will see with each type of seizure and medications used to treat a seizure. At the conclusion of this video, the nurse should be able to identify the appropriate care for a client with seizures. Assessment begins with looking for altered motor, sensory, autonomic, or psychic activity due to abnormal discharge from brain cells. Implementation or care of the client with seizures during the seizure. Protect from injury. You want to use padded side rails if that's part of your agency policy or ease the client to the floor, protect the head, perhaps putting a pillow underneath their head so if they're moving their head around they won't be banging in on the floor. Do not restrain. Do not insert anything in the mouth, no padded tongue blades and nothing in the mouth. It can cause injury. Position on the side with the neck extended. Monitor onset, duration and pattern of the seizure and administer meds for status epilepticus, giving the med during a seizure that is not stopping. After the seizure, you're going to position on side to prevent aspiration, reduce environmental stimuli, provide oxygen and suction as needed, provide orientation, teach about medications, seizure triggers, one of which is bright flashing lights, at a ketogenic diet, which is a diet high in fat and low in carbs, the state of ketosis suppresses many types of seizures. So there's some education going on there with the implementation after the seizure. Document description of seizure. Here is your practice question. Let's read it together. The nurse cares for a client experiencing seizure activity. The nurse should intervene if which intervention is observed. The side rails are raised on the client's bed. There is suction at the client's bedside. There is an oxygen setup at the client's bedside. A padded tongue blade is placed on the client's bedside table. Side rails are raised on the client's bed. If they're padded, that's good, but you have to use the side rails as per agency policy, but it is part of the safety. There is suction at the client's bedside. That is correct. We are looking for the incorrect answer. There is an oxygen set up at the client's bedside. That is correct. And the padded tongue blade is placed on the client's bedside table. Is the incorrect answer? We do not put anything in the client's mouth. It can cause further injury.